About 23 years ago, I suffered a spinal cord injury that left me a quadriplegic and where I couldn't do things that I was used to doing on my own. A friend of mine knew about Patient Paws and she contacted Patient Paws and they contacted me and thought they had a dog that would be perfect for me. For me, it was love at first sight. Jules was like, what's going on? All I had to do was give her a treat and um, that won her over. When I do drop something and I'll say, bring it. Oh no, I dropped my keys. Oh, bring it. Bring it, Jules. Come on. Thank you. Thank you. Good girl. She had never worked with anybody in a wheelchair before. Another thing she wasn't used to doing was getting into a van, and I have a lift that comes out the side. We've got her to stay behind me and wait until I get pulled in, and then she'll come around and We've got a mat back there for her to lay down on. She's doing very good with that. These are my sisters, Harriet and Valerie. I'm happy that Margie has Jules in her life now because <clears throat> I was Margie's service animal before <laughs> Jules. So now that we have Jules, I don't have to come over to pick up the cell phone or pick up the keys. and. Um, not only is Jules a great helping dog, but she's also a great companion dog. And when Margie, when, I, when we go to doctor's appointments and Margie gets out of the car and she's on her own with Jules going up the elevator into the doctor's offices and they're on their own, Jules really does serve as a great companion and as, as, a, um, and as a distraction for the wheelchair that Margie's in and people um, want to approach her even more because they, because they see this cute little furry animal with her. But Patient Paws has really, I don't know, been a good, that I can tell, it put out a good vibe and everything with our family, with Marjorie, and definitely with Jules. Great addition to the family. Hi, I'm Margie's son, Glenn, um, here for her placement party with Jules. And just so excited that she has the dog uh, again. Um, this will be her third service dog and everyone's been a huge help. Um, you know, little things like when she drops the remote or just um, makes her be at ease when she goes out in public. And uh, I'm grateful and I know she's grateful to Patient Paws for making that happen. Hi, I am Nancy. I am one of Margie's three sisters and I'm so excited to meet Jules and I'm so glad the two of them found each other. I can already see they are in love with each other and I look forward to watching Jules grow up and their relationship blossom. They've been wonderful. Debbie's just been unbelievable, unbelievably so kind. I mean, just to be doing something like this out of the goodness of their hearts for someone that could really use the help, it's just, there are no words. Really, it's just, says a lot about, about who she is and, and who she represents. So thank you very much for this wonderful, beautiful gift that you're giving my sister. I mean it. Mean it. Pretty girl, pretty girl. I can't wait till tonight. We're having a official celebration where Jules is going to officially be a part of my household. I want to thank Margie. She's our first service dog recipient, and she's had so much patience, and she's been so kind and understanding. Um, she's kind of been our guinea pig, so um, she's been amazing. Um, so we really appreciate Margie and um, kind of allowing us to do our trial and error thing. So thank you, Margie. <laughs> Ha, ha, ha.
your service dog now. So, to the 